let's say you're well on your way to making breakfast and you realize you're out of something that you must have to complete this breakfast. What normally happens is you might gather some kids, jump in the car and drive 25 minutes to the grocery store. You get everyone out of the car, walk into the store, walk all the way in to get what you need, walk back, get everybody back in the car, drive all the way home. Get back to the house, transition everybody in and start cooking again. Hey, Laura, we've been trying to help. That's a normal response. So thankfully, I'm not a normal person. I ran out of eggs once while cooking and I didn't have to go to the store. Ready? I want to show you how I did that and to show you, I told the story in my trailer for permaculture chickens, my film on how to raise chickens from hatching to the plate. So I want you to watch this trailer and be sure to watch it all the way through because at the end I'm going to tell you three fun facts about some loopholes in that high production trailer we shot to promote that movie. I'm Justin Rose from Asheville, North Carolina, husband to a beautiful wife named Rebecca, father of four beautiful children, homesteader, permaculturalist, chicken farmer. I'm noticing that a lot of people are wanting to start to grow their own food. I was one of them several years ago. I was just wanting a more healthy food with a story that I knew where it came from. So I started growing my own food, but what I, what I started to notice was I didn't know what in the world I was doing. It was so difficult to learn. I started picking up books and researching online, but still, it wasn't quite what I was looking for. I kind of needed a mentor or an uncle or somebody who was into it. So now I look to the books, but the books don't always have the answer. So I thought that if people are out there wanting to learn this stuff, I want to help them out. And uh, I want to teach them. I think there's a quick and easy way to do it. I, I want to shorten their learning curve. I'd like to start with chickens. A lot of people start with uh, chickens. They're very easy. They're uh, phenomenal to work with. They're good workers in the garden. They're just a great entry. Some of the things we'll cover is how to cut feed costs by 100%, how to build your own housing, how to process your own birds, how to cook your own birds, how to breed your own for 100% sustainability. So we're gonna have uh, pioneer and author Joel Salatin of Polyface Farms and Jim Atkins of the Sustainable Poultry Network come and give us their expertise. I'm going to teach you everything there is to know from hatching your own chicks to putting them on your dinner table and everything in between. Some of the most beautiful moments in my life are when my wife puts down a plate of food and you have a couple of vegetables and you have a meat there and I'm, I can tell a story to that food. For everybody who wants to experience the joy of growing their own chicken products. I'm going to show you how easy it is to be there along with you every step of the way. Okay, hope you enjoyed that classic story, classic problem solving with food in your 
backyard. It's a convenience, guys, a major convenience, besides the health factors and all the other good stuff. The fun facts. One, those were not my pajamas. I don't wear pajamas, I wear boxers. They were not appropriate for the movie, so I wore Rebecca's pajamas, my wife's pajamas, the pants. Second funny thing about that movie, when we're all having dinner together, do you see that nice china? If you're a vlog fan, you might wonder, where's that nice china I never see in the box? That's because we borrowed it from a friend. Another one is that everybody was looking you know, jovial and happy and laughing. And yes, we are that. But if you have to capture that in a specific moment, how do you do that? Well, I t we went around the table and I told everyone to tell the most embarrassing story about themselves. Yeah? What do you need? Oh, I thought he was, I thought he was needing me. You're doing a great job, by the way, Jonah. Okay. So I had everybody tell embarrassing stories and we all laughed and had a good time and we were able to capture it on film. That trailer was for my movie, Permaculture Chickens. This is our three year anniversary, y'all. So I've literally taught tens of thousands of people how to raise their own chickens from hatching all the way to the plate. Now, so many people have the satisfaction of knowing where their food comes from, having something to, that they can do together as a family, having the convenience of their food in their backyard, having the health factor of it being the healthiest food you can actually grow. You cannot buy this in the grocery store. Now to celebrate three years, three years y'all, I'm gonna give this movie away for free. I'm gonna give it away for 48 hours. What is this weekend? 8 p.m. Eastern through Sunday and then till Monday at let's say 10 p.m. Eastern, you can watch it for free at your leisure as many times as you want. You guys about to let them out? You guys, I don't want to miss you letting them out, okay? Oh, is that hanging up that high? Look, it has to be that to make that. Oh, I think I can help you fix that. Put the corners diagonal. You did do it pretty much. I helped you a little bit up the hill, but that was more for time's sake. How old are you, Jonah? Ten. Ten. <laughs> How old are you, Josiah? Eight. And you move these chickens from way over there to way over here, good job. Hey, good morning to you. Good morning to you, are you excited? You like doing this, Shannon? Yeah, one or it would have been too, the sun wouldn't be able to get there that well. So I'm moving it over this Oh, point. good call, good call. Thanks for helping him. You're welcome. On the scale of one to 10, how hard was that? 10 being like uh, algebra. I think it was about six. Six? On a scale of one to 10, how hard was that? 10 being algebra, zero being eating cake. How easy was it for you, Ben? There with that coffee. It's about, about this easy. <laughs> hey, they need some supervision, right? <laughs> hey, there's a couple times I had to help them push up the hill. But for kids to be able to do this, that's amazing. Now you pull down the door. You pull down the door, Josiah. Free the birds. Fire, stand back. So they probably had a rough journey. I would say so. They're probably very happy to be out. Okay, see if we got breakfast in there. You already got the eggs. Oh, you already got the eggs out of there. So I hope you'll join us for the free viewing. Sign up, it's totally free, no obligation. And if you sign up and then share it, we've got a bonus for you right now.